Hi everyone, my name is David White and I'm the Content Marketing Director here at Connected Free. Today I am going to do a really, really super quick vlog and it's on something that I think is really, really important. And it's actually about understanding where your audience is and difference in that from trends. So let me give you an example, right? The trend right now, I say right now, it's been a pretty hot trend for the past couple of years, is TikTok. Everybody's on TikTok. You can make the largest companies sell even more. You can make tiny companies go absolutely viral because of the video sharing platform. But does that mean that you need to be on it? Well, it depends, right? That's what it depends. If your audience is not on TikTok, then don't go on TikTok just because it's a trend. If your audience isn't on LinkedIn, then do not do big personal branding or whatever on LinkedIn because you're not gonna get in front of the right people. Okay, just because something is trending, just because a platform is trending, just because a certain market inactivation or whatever is trending, does not necessarily mean that it's gonna pay dividends for you. So what you need to understand, right, is who your audience is and where they hang around online and then work back from that. I see too many brands just saying, we must do TikTok, we must do uh, Instagram, we must do this, when actually nobody's ever gonna buy from you or even remember you on them platforms, so it's a complete waste of time, effort and resource. So how do you find where people or your customers hang around online? And where, how do you find the information? Well, the simple answer for me is, is really easy. There's two sides. First of all, is social listening. The second of all is obviously things like surveys and questionnaires to your client, uh, client or customer base. So I've talked about social listening in great detail over the past year, um, but I promise you it is super, super important, but more importantly, it's super, super valuable. So social listening allows you to input your brand, your social channels into the, the system, and it will tell you people who have visited your site, people who've talked about your site, people who follow you on social media, um, where they also hang around online, where do they uh, where do they spend most of their time? It might be surprising. It could be places like Reddit. It could be forums. It could be reading sites such as the Daily Mail. So if you're thinking to yourself, well, actually, you know, everyone's doing TikTok. I must do TikTok. They might not be there. I mean, they may well be, and that could be a definite solution for you, but they may not be as well. And you might have to start understanding how do we target Reddit? How do we target Pinterest or, or wherever it may be? Now, I'm going to link through in the description of this video to some uh, videos I've done and vlogs I've done on, on social listening. But I would say this to anybody watching this video. If something is trending, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's right for you, okay? It, you need to go where your customers are going. You need to understand who your customers are, what they want to share, where they want to hang around online and who they follow. That information is critical before you do any kind of marketing. And if you haven't done that bit, then I would worry that the effort and the resource and the time that you're putting into marketing may not pay off as much as you think it will. So my advice for anyone is go back, speak to your customers, maybe run social listening, understand who they are, and then work back from that point rather than jumping on trends just because it is the trend. That was it, really quick vlog. Like I say, the videographers here are fed up with filming me today. I do wear other clothes and um, watch out for, for the other vlogs in which I'm wearing this exact same. Uh, yeah, thank you for listening and uh, stay safe.